Welcome to episode 11 of the Grass Pet Podcast. My name is Clayton Carpenter. I'm with the one and only Edgar Carbio. Uh-huh. <laughs> We're live from Placencia. What's going on, Edgar? Right here, man, enjoying the night, you know. It's nothing better than Belize. It's better Belize. You better Belize it. <laughs> yeah. What's, uh, what's the plan for the new place? The evolution of Evolution Beach. So Evolution is coming with a stronger design, you know. Stronger customer service, more service for everybody, physiotherapy, factors. It's all about fitness. So we are trying to make the evolution on Placencia with good feelings. You know, people who have injuries from working many years, they've been in companies or maybe in their own business, or the stress that they accumulate is being something that made their life uncomfortable. So with the option that we have with this gym, that we make release all of those kind of um, stresses that make your muscle get swell. So when your muscle gets swell, all, all the articulations and your vertebrae get pressure. So when you make the muscle get released and the inflammation go, the vertebrae could have this compression, so they have more freedom, more flexibility, people who have less pain, because the, the body is flexible. So that's what we are about, is more about training for people who need to get better, not really to get both, to keep healthy, uh, lower back, strong lower back, nice shoulders with a lot of muscles around. It's not really about get big or both, it's about just to have enough to balance and keep the articulations strong, you know. Mm. So it's a nice, circuit that everybody in the world could try. It's just two weeks that you need to feel the difference in evolution with gym. If you suffer from pain or you have a lot of problems with headaches, we are specialized in that. That's why everybody now is talking about us in Belize, you know. Maybe we are not really going too far in the internet and those things because we was too busy trying to help people. So we don't have time to get in the in the media side, you know, but now we are having more capacity, people who is working with all that understand more the, the work, you know, and the process, so now I have time for going to these things, and you know Clayton Carpenter here, he's specialized on those things, so we want to make business grow, and you know what is this, you know what we are talking about, you know, we are getting used to for making it, so we want to make this thing going around the world, because it's a mission, I think Evolution Based Gym is made for help people, you know, people who really are deserve to be in a place like this. You don't have to be in Placencia Belize with pain or with bad feelings. But here is to enjoy, you know. You drink, you work out, you eat. It's like a cycle. You do your maintenance, like a car, you need maintenance. Okay, you go drink, you go eat, but do your maintenance, you know. At least one time a week, two times a week. You are sweating whatever you are putting in, so your machine gonna be flexible, man. But if you not do maintain it one of these days, your machine gonna go down. So this is evolution be gym, man. It's just about help everybody. Nice. Yeah, man. So you got a new location coming? Yeah, we are gonna build it on Placencia Point. When you go to the end of the road, you could go to the right side where is Jaybird Bar and see her as dive shop. So I'm going to be in between Seahorse Dive Shop and Jebos Bar. Whoa. So we're going to be with a good view, watching the sea, right the nature, the right in the water, you know. We're going to be doing the best thing, you know. You, you need to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. uh, we will put some advices for everybody see how the project is going. And we're going to share it with you, man. Once we start to do the project, we're going to keep in touch so grass feed could be in the rhythm too. Yeah. Because it's a good thing that it's growing together, you know, nature is like natural medicine with evolution is the best thing. That's what we are trying to do. Not use too much chemical that affect different things on you. But we detox that, we bring all that with herbs, you know. We have the best quality herbs in Belize. Yeah, it's where the place, the pirates bring so many things that make benefits for us. Like how we have a lot of fruits, mangoes, coconuts, cashews. Like that, we have a variety of nice herbs for medicine. Actually, the strongest 
that any kind of chemicals, when you put them together, you realize that everything that you are drinking with chemicals, it comes from them. So this is the root, man. Evolution, big game, yes. Get back to the basics. Yeah, get back to the basics, like how the classic time used to be. Yeah, when you remember, you remember in the old times, they you know, used to have so much like hospitals and those things, but they used to have herbalistics. Mm -hmm. People who know and got knowledge about the, the herbs, you know. Now we see even in the iPhones, we see some apps that tell you what kind of herbs and those things. So we was, before that, that happened, we was up to that technology, you know, because we recognize with our sense of nature, my eyes and the feeling of connection with the, with the plants, you know. They could tell you if you get so much into this spiritual feeling with healing, you will get so close to the nature that you could feel that power of healing, man. It's like energy. So it's not, it's not just about working, you know. Yeah. <laughs> you got into the healing from your grandfather, right? Yeah, my grandfather, he was one of the famous ones in Belize. He's Eleutero Carvalho, you know, chiropractor, you know. He did it since he's in the army with the England people. So he came here in those classic times, you know. So he made a Belizean girl, which, my, which is my grandma. So, and then my mom come. So I come from the same roots, and he teach me what he got me. And he explained me that that's the only thing that he could teach me, but he wanted to teach me 100% of it. And he think that gonna make successful feeling for me, and make everybody happy, and that was his mission. He just want to help people. He had everything, but he want to teach this and make the people of his healing, you know, make the people know how I feel this. It's so hard to explain it because um, it's a combination of feelings, spiritual things, herbs. So it's just to be here and feel it. It's, uh, it's a good invitation for all the world, man. Yeah, you should get healed. So yeah, it's, it's easy, you know, it's sometimes people just make it look like it's hard and maybe you work for for many things so you don't pay attention when people tell you you got pain, so you have to pay for this. Right here it's not really about the money, it's about your, you know, it's about the real feeling of when somebody gives you the feeling of I'm, I'm better and you make it to me, so that feeling is what I'm looking for, you know, that makes me strong. That's the part of my work. When I see somebody that get healed, they make me feel it like, hey, I get healed. And those eyes make me get strong, full of energy, a lot of positive power. So I get stronger, man. It's, it's something that I can't describe, but I would like you feel it. You know? Yeah, uh, it's nice. Yeah, man. That's super cool. So, uh, for instance, like my, my stepdad, Dave, like you, he was, like I told you earlier, he was on the verge of going back to the States seeing a back specialist. What do you do with someone like that? What, what was his situation when you saw him and how did you address it? So the first thing you do with this um, kind of situation, you get the patient and you put it in the floor and you start to search each muscle. Reflexology is going to tell you what is happening according to the inflammation in your muscles and where they are located. So for example, if I find hand strings very tight, I know lower back going to have problems, hips going to be stiff. So if I find a uh, middle back very tight, very stiff, I know your neck and your shoulders going to be like racks. So when you work on these muscles, you don't go to the place where is the hard part. You go to the pressure points. That's why we use reflexology. We search each line. So it's no machine that could tell you so exactly when your hands are going on top each muscle in your body touching and your hands get so much experience from many years working on this like I'm doing it that I could tell you when the muscle is swelling just to touch it anyone is yeah it's my nature, you know, I think I'm getting very like when somebody lose the, the vision, he get better in different things. I don't use the vision on this, I use my feeling, my tact. So I've been doing it so much that my tact now is 100%. He could feel it from far, why is an injury, why is a muscle tear, you know, why is a joint problem, you know, a stiffness in your neck, 
you have to know how to treat this. It's not about pressure them and put strength. It's about to find the starting of the problem from the roots of the muscle, you know, nerves. I know all of those things, so I, for me it's like, it's, it's like a, when a mechanic get a car and you tell him, hey, you know, my car is having this problem. You don't even realize how he's going to do it, but he's going to listen and search it, touch it, move it. He's going to fix it because he knows what is that, so I'm a boy mechanic, man. And I know, okay. and I know I born for this, like how about Mahler born for sing reggae. Mm -hmm. I, I born for him people, you know, and I know the world want to know this because I've been doing it since I'm small and that made me stronger. I, in the beginning I never believed it so hard because I was too young, but when you get older and mature, you start to realize what the real deal man. we are made combination with the earth and the energy earth. So we are power, man. we are energy like the electricity. So energy is what makes this world move. If the world stop move the circle, everything shut down. That's why that's why our body it shouldn't stop. Never sit down on the table and eat or watch TV and just take it easy. At least do a little swimming, a little walking, something because this is our nature, we have to move. If we don't move, something will happen. So we have to do something, you know, even when you are too busy in the computer, you stand up for 10 minutes and you move your hands up, down, stretch a little bit and continue. That's the, the landmine of the earth. You have to move, keep movement. Evolution be gym 100%, you know. We are top, yes. What about uh, this picture you showed me of the woman in the bed when you're doing in-home therapies? Oh, know. yeah, this is a nice therapy that actually is when people can't really move from their bed because they have very serious injuries or they are maybe overweight. So we got trainings on the bed that we use towels, we use rubber bands, you know, rubber band exercise. So we use different kind of uh, home style workout. But we create it according to your, your problem, you know, or maybe your issue. So we, we make a special routine every time. It's not really like for everybody the same. But we build it up, man. So for me, it's something that has been working. Because in Placencia now, most of the people is people who is retired. So they need a treatment, you know, they need a little stretching. A little, you know, maintaining some of those muscles because when you get 40, 50, the muscles start to go away. So once you feed them with something, make them feel the flow of the blood, they keep, you know, so that's what we need. And these people sometimes maybe is no, um, not able to go to the gym. So we go there and we make it happen, man. Because we are evolution and we have to prove it, man. And we're going to make it because it's happening. Cool. Yes. So how do you feel about, as we talked a little bit about natural medicine, so what about Moringa? About oh, Moringa, Moringa is one of the things that is going around the world as a really nice thing, you know, it's the miracle plant. So it has so many benefits, even proteins, amino acids, you know, you hear about those things, it is full of properties, you know. So when you combine those things with different roots and different things, or if you drink it just as a tea, that's going to help a lot, detox your body. Sometimes when your body is detox, it not really let you get the minerals that you need, not really let you get um, relaxed with your stomach. You, it keeps you uncomfortable, you know? So that's not really nice. So that's why when you use Moringa, you make your whole system get detox. You know, this compress inside, so it, it clean it, man, it's a nice thing. Pro it got properties like protein that when you don't eat proteins in the day, and you want to reduce some weight, even if you drink this tea, you are getting some protein, so it helps you to reduce fat, cholesterol, and it helps you to keep going up with the energy because it has proteins, you know. And we are made of protein. Yeah, the human is made of protein, so once you have things that bring you proteins, even your brain gonna stay for fire, man. You're scared me. Fun feeling. Gonna hurt somebody behind me. All right. <laughs> yes. <laughs>
Nice. That's yeah. cool. Um, let's talk about the gym. The gym you founded. You talked about that a little bit? Oh, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, I started in Panama at this gym with my friends, you know. So I was competing for the Confederation of Panama, doing some records, you know. And then they see the opportunity that... Don't be modest. You were the, you're the Panama champion. Yeah, as I was doing the best thing in Panama first play, you know, 85 kilograms. So yeah, I have to keep it up. So I get the record there, first place, and you know, this is a thing that I was feeling as a young boy, something so excited, and I enjoy it so much. So this guy tell me, hey, let's invest on on this gym. So I tell him, okay. So I get a good payment every month, you know, good salary. But in that time, I never was thinking about work by myself. So. I started to build this empire, but I never was realizing that it want to be so big. So it gets so big that now I even look on it and I get inspiration. And I know it's from my friends and it could be my one because I started from my roots and my style. I make the trainers, I make all the design and those things, you know. So my friend have the money to make it. So that is his part and I appreciate that because he he helped me for find myself too. I passed that, that stage that it was very hard to me. Uh, and the time when I realized that this is not mine, and I've been working in something that is not mine, but that made me be who I am now. Made me see that I could make maybe 10 more of them because it was so interesting to make it so lovely, you know. So I like that feeling. I'm looking for that feeling again. But well, this time is coming Revolution Beach Gym Belize. So this is gonna be harder, man. Because I'm the guy who created that piece there. So now this is gonna be in Belize and I'm gonna be I'm gonna be bigger than that. Yeah man, and I appreciate you know how Lester get it too because he deserved it man. Yeah. He invests on it, he put time on it, he helped me in many things too, so it's his gym. Even if I put my name my records on it, but he's my friend and that's a big value. Man. Yeah. I'm gonna put now my one and he, any support, he got the things too. So you know, we are a good family in the world, man. Yeah. yeah. So yes. you're building this new place right over here on the beach. Yeah, right there on the beach. So it's gonna be outdoor, the best thing. Outdoor gym, indoor gym. Outdoor gym. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're gonna have a nice space too. We're gonna have a, a little bar with nutrition. So we're gonna have like a cocktails with fruits, like shakes, um, smoothies, like your famous um, moringa tea that you have in, yeah. the, in the marketing, you know. So that kind of that kind of healthy thing we're gonna be promoting, and we're gonna have so many different kind of uh, medicine for pain, like natural medicine, you know. A lot of things going on with that that medicine. Like now it's getting very good the cannabis with coconut oil. So that is a nice um, essential oil for massage that relax very nice. Ah, the body, man, it's a nice thing to try. The real cannabis and real coconut oil, no artificial, no nothing, is organic, everything. So the pure things go penetrating your muscles, you know. So, yeah, man, we're going to have that place there. If somebody is interested to start a natural life, you know, we're going to be ready. We could start from little things. It may be if you are get used to for uh, medicine that is supporting you with um, sugar, you know, and those things there. We have medicine natural that to handle you the same way like how this medicine is handling you. So we create, we compose, and when you feel it, you know, going to it right away, all the way in. You start to do it a little bit by a little bit, drinking your medicine and some natural until you start to live the artificial and you start to use pure natural slowly. Yeah man, we're gonna make this cycle, you know. After this, everybody gonna be excited with this natural thing, man. It's getting big. Yeah, it's getting you big. You see more people in the village? Yeah, more people you now every every day is coming from this um this new island, Hachiskitu. Mm. Yeah, so they are doing this man, they are bringing more people, you know. It's nice. It's, it's growing, it's growing. Super cool. Yeah, I mean. Well, uh, what about these boys training, these guys, big guys, training for the kickboxing? Oh, yeah, these two guys are going to compete in San Pedro the 18th of this month. So, so 
they are getting ready now. We are doing a good training now. Uh, we are working um, at least um, six rounds of uh, punching bag. We do um, 30 minutes of explosive cardio, you know, and then after that we go for a little physical movement, practice shadow boxing, you know. A lot of different kind of techniques for make them get better, you know. Kickboxing is an extreme thing, but it's very nice, man. These guys has been um, working for maybe two years. They have been some local shows that they've been winning, so I would like to support them to go out because it's a small place that needs to be supported, you know. So we need to help the, the young kids coming out with that sport to me. So our gym is sponsored the whole community. Once you got 13 years to 18 years, you have free gym at Evolution Beach Gym if you are a local guy. So this is free, you know. So you know, pay. The people who is being our customers, they are doing this for us. So I'm trying to this guy expand and the young generation get old too because the sport is a is a big door for people who don't really um, got a lot of options. But when you have a trophy in your hand, you could tell anybody that you have responsibility and you want to get better and you are already proving it. So anybody will listen and tell you, okay, I could help you with at least something. So this is a, a door that I'm trying to open for the new generation in in Belize and Placentia, you know, giving this uh, sponsoring to anybody who is 13 to 18 years, so it's free. We got everything, equipment. My mission is to you get in somewhere, compete, and say, hey, I was at Evolution Beach Gym, so I'm doing evolution, you know, I'm doing evolve. So I want to evolve the system, man. I want to make these uh, these young kids who maybe not got the money for making it. Uh, they don't have the space like uh, the big countries who have a big school where you could train and you have the facilities. But right here is a small place and we don't have it. But once I got it, everybody got it, man. So I'm going to give it to them because it's iron. So keep calm and bet iron. Yeah. This is one done. This is, this is going to be here, man, for long. Yes. I like it. I like it. Yeah, man. Well, that's a wrap. I'm Clayton Carpenter. This is Edgar Carbio, probably one of the most impactful people that I've come in contact to while in Belize, especially in Placencia. Thank you so much for everything. All right, you yes, are. I want to say the last thing. If you got somebody hey, right there and he's suffering from pain or he maybe had a stroke, I promise that I could fix that. I could fix that. I could heal it, you know, for real. And if I not do it, you could put there in my page or anywhere and say, you are a liar, you know. You know, heal my family. I accept that. I want to tell you, hey, do whatever if I know heal a part of your family. I want to heal it. I promise, like, I want to do it because I know, I, I know inside me is, this is my patient, it's my art. So I take it like an artist who paints. You can't tell him he don't want to paint because he want to paint. I want to paint, man, I know what I'm doing. So I got it, man, and I know I want to share it. Even it's not expensive, right here, just nothing, just come. I'm going to be free the first time. You know, after that, I won't charge like big money. The only cost now is 200 a month for, you know, for subscription Evolution Beach Gym. And one therapy of 50 minutes to check what is the problem. You're going to be just 20 bellies. So it's not a big deal, you know, and you could get healed. So the most you want to spend is one month. You want to invest one month on you, and you want to have a good vacation in Belize, Placencia, and you want to get healed. You want to go back without pain, very nice, very relaxed, you know. So it's going to be a nice thing that you're going to discover this 2020 coming, man, in the new Evolution Beach Gym. I want to know it. I want to everybody know it because I want to make it happen, man. I want to heal the people, and I want to tell them, if I know him, you put it in the whole internet and tell them this is a liar. But I know that won't happen because I'm going to heal anybody who come here, man. I promise that to the world. And this is my mission here, and I'm going to make it. Yes, Evolution Beijing 100%, you know. All right. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, man. Good night. Here, when it's the end of the road, we go to the right side. Oh, boy.